Hi guys, it's Angelia. How's everybody doing today? Today is the last day of Vlogmas. It's day 31 and it's New Year's Eve, so Happy New Year's everyone. It'll be, by the time my video gets uploaded, it'll be New Year's Day. So, anyway, um, I don't have, well, I do have a couple of things to show you, so uh, thought I'd share with you the progress on my uh, blanket. And I also started um, something tonight for New Year's Eve, just some little something I wanted to start up and work on it tomorrow too. So, but anyway, let me show you my blanket. I did do a little bit on it today, but it, it uh, I didn't get real far. I mean, seems like I should have got further, but I didn't. <laughs> so, see if I can get it over here without pulling it out. All right. Here we are. I got, I think I was down here somewhere. I think I started on the light green. And then, so I end up just doing uh, half double crochets and double crochet. And then I end up doing the front post, back post stitch. And and then I put in the white. And then I did it, uh, the green again, the light green, with front post, back post again. And just, just did random little stitches in between there. I wish now on the white, I wished I would have done like the bobble stitch to make it look like maybe uh, snowballs or something on there, but I didn't think about it till I got up here a while ago and I thought, oh man, I should have done that because I put the front post, back post here to make it look like, uh, represent a tree. <laughs> That's my idea. But my next, uh, I think my next row is the light green here, the, uh, olive green and then when I get to the I'll add the white again and then I'm going to try my hand at the bobble stitch anyway I got that much done so far I think it's turning out pretty good I'm trying my best to keep my my ends straight <laughs> and I'm also sewing in my ends as I go I'm going to do that this time and still wait until the very end <laughs> and then I think on my border I think I'm just going to do a double crochet all the way around it just something simple. But I can't wait to get it done to put it back there and then get maybe started on a pillow. And I'm doing it in, the color I'm on right now is dark olive. It's the Hobby Lobby. I love this yarn. And the other one is the Light Sage. And I've got another skein of this one, but this one I've only got the one. So I'm probably going to have to get me another one. So you know what that means. <laughs> Trip to Hobby Lobby or probably order some. And then I'm just doing it in the mainstay white. But I also have another green in there if I run out of this one. It's a little bit different than this, but I might use it instead. I don't know. We'll see. I think it'll still be pretty. And I'm using a, I think this is a five and a half. Yep. Five and a half millimeter hook. Okay. Now, the next thing I want to show you is what I started tonight. A couple of months ago, I ended up getting this book. It's by Sarah Zimmerman, and it's the Crochet Cute Critters, and it's got 26 of them in there. And it's, I believe, the, it's the, uh, the alphabet's what it is. But I had to have it, and I got it off of Amazon, and I think I paid like $7 and some change for it. And you, if you have Prime, you, you have free shipping. So, but anyway, that's a good deal for that book. But it's got some of the cutest patterns in here. Here it is. On what's on the inside there. I couldn't resist. So, I decided being that it's New Year's Eve. I wanted to start at the very beginning, which is the alligator. And I have never made an alligator. And it's really cute. So, let's see if I can get the picture of it up here without showing you the pattern. Should have had it bookmarked, I guess. Let's see if I can do this. I don't really want to bend the page. Let's see. There we are. <laughs> Isn't he cute? <laughs> oh, he's so cute. But let me show you how far I've gotten so far. Okay. I didn't even my little project bag. I made I made this a couple of years ago. It's a little pinwheel one. Okay. Let me get got it 
I got the this much done, the body, and then I've got the head. That's what I got so far. And I gotta make his still gotta make his snout and his eyes and his tail and his legs. So I'm excited. I've never made an alligator before. So I can't wait to keep on working on him. I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, intentionally just work on him tomorrow. I'm, I'm gonna try my best not to touch my blanket. <laughs> but I might I don't know. I'd like to get him all done up tomorrow. So I'd be my amigurumi for the first of the year. But anyway, I'm doing it in the mainstay green. Now this is a different kind of green than the mainstay green that they have uh, this year this year I don't know I don't think they have this I don't I haven't seen this one anymore so I don't know if they could discontinue this one or not but I love this one this and it looks kind of like that spring green I think that Red Heart uh, has but I love this one I, I use this on like making my Grinch and all my other Christmassy stuff because it's really a pretty green okay well that's what I have to show you uh, for this year <laughs> and I have had so much fun doing vlogmas I, I just want to say thank you for following me all this time um, I hope I wasn't too boring <laughs> but I had a lot of fun you know you guys leaving your 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 sweet comments and you know all your comments it encouraged me just to keep going and, and make all of them and everything and and getting to share all my my vintage Christmas with you that was really a lot of fun too and that got me to thinking about, I thought about starting another channel just strictly just to show my vintage and antique, you know, flea market kind of finds. You know, I'm not a pro at it whatsoever. I don't know a whole lot about them. I just do it for fun. I just collect it for myself. And, you know, I go up online and try to find out about a certain object and get Four different answers so you know like I said I'm not a pro at this I just do it just to collect but I, I enjoyed it sharing it with you guys and and I think a lot of you seem to have enjoyed it and it you know it brought it brings back a lot of memories for me for a lot of the stuff that I find and I thought it'd be kind of fun hopefully this next year especially the one antique store that's my favorite to be are talking about opening back up in the spring and so that makes me really excited because that's where I find a lot of my Christmas stuff. And I thought if I'm able to find the vintage Christmas throughout the year, Lord willing, I get to do the Vlogmas again in December, I'll share the Christmas then. But throughout the year, whenever I do go and I find anything, I'd like to share it with you guys. And I thought about just, you know, starting maybe a different channel just to kind of keep it separate, I guess. I don't know. I hadn't even thought of a name or anything, but... If I decide to do it, if it's not set in stone yet, but, you know, if any of you guys are interested in that, just let me know down below in the comments and I'll do, I'll set one up and, you know, and I've got, you know, I've got antiques and vintage things now that I can start sharing with you guys. Just, you know, I love it. It's fun because I know a lot of you said it brought back memories for you and you remember having it and your mom and them have it and, your grandmother you know it's just it's fun going down the the memory road i guess you could say <laughs> brings back a lot of memories for me and i love it but anyway just a thought well anyway again thank you so much i enjoyed it my first this was my first vlogmas like i said mine wasn't you know i tried to keep it as short as i could on my videos because you know i try not to keep them too long but i i try <laughs> But anyway, I guess I'm going to hop off of here and and uh, call it an evening. Maybe work, might, might work on my alligator a little bit more. Maybe bring in the new year. I don't know. I used to, but the older I get, the more I just want to go to bed. <laughs> but anyway, I just want to say thank you again. And I'll be probably making a video maybe Sunday this weekend. I don't know. I don't have any set days for my videos except maybe Wednesday when I do my Whip Wednesday <laughs> video. But I'll... I'll be getting back into my one a day, maybe two a day, who two or her a week that is, and uh, just depends on my mood. I might pop up even more. Who knows? It's not set in stone. <laughs> I guess I'll quit rambling and I'm gonna get off of here, 
and I hope you guys have a wonderful, blessed, happy new year, and I will be chatting at you real soon. <laughs>